Hey guys, it's Toby with a quick video for you. I've heard a lot about this free mobile service. It's been around a long time and I thought it was time to check it out. So what I have here with me today is a phone that I purchased from Freedom Pop directly. It costs 40 bucks, free shipping, it just arrived. We're gonna open it up, check it out, see what we have today. And then hopefully I'll be able to follow up with some videos and tell you is the free service even worth it? So let's get the box open today. Again, this just came in the mail today, so I haven't opened it at all. I'm kind of assuming it's Freedom Pop. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it is. Actually, just uh, this is uh, Saturday, and I just ordered it. I think Monday, so it came pretty quickly. All right, so it's definitely the Freedom Pop package, and this is the phone that that I got. It's an HTC Desire 510. Uh, looks like it's in blue. Definitely, you know, Freedom Pop packaging. Reminds me a lot of the packaging, like if you buy a retail, like Walmart, prepaid, you know, T-Mobile kind of phone. You can see the phone through the packaging. Um, free service, free, or fast speeds, no contract. Um, free basic plan, 100% free so on and so forth. I've heard good things, I've heard bad things. Uh, now as far as the phone itself, down here at the bottom it's telling us Android 4.4, 3G, 4G LTE, 1 gig of RAM, 4 gigs of ROM. I didn't realize it only had 4 gigs, but it was a $40 phone, 4.7 inch screen, 5 megapixel camera. Um, again, it's, it's, a, it's $40, so it's not an expensive device. Let's go ahead and uh, pop this open. Oh, it says here, What's in the box? Desire 510 micro SD card. So it does, they are including a micro SD card. A battery, quick start guide, wall charger, USB cable. Activate by calling this number. So, all right. So let's zip this open. Set the box aside. Let's see here. Now I've personally uh, never used an HTC Desire phone, so I don't really know what to expect. Um, I mean, there's not a whole lot in the box to, to really look at. Um, Feel the front off. It's not a bad looking phone. Um, it's got a nice soft touch texture. Obviously I'm seeing here there's no flash on the back. Again, this is not a high end phone. You can get their service with other phones, but this is just kind of a, a cheap, Phone. It was the cheapest one I saw, just something that I wanted to try their service with. Um, so I want to see if it actually does come with a with a micro SD card because you know I bet I bet it's in it already. Let's see how the I can tell how the the back is not on all the way. I bet it's already in it. Yep, it's already in it. It's a four gig card, so the phone can phone has eight gigs internal. Um, or did it say four? Let's see again. Yeah, it's got four gigs of internal, which we know isn't a lot for Android. It comes with a four gig card. I'll see how that goes. I've got some bigger cards if I want to try one. Um, but all in all, the device itself is about what I would have expected um, for a $40 device. Quick start guide, some warning labels. Let's see. Yeah, it looks like just a... Uh, there's a wall charger. That's sealed up, but yeah, it's a wall charger, and this is probably just the uh, micro USB. All right, so so we're gonna we're gonna set this up, and we'll give it a shot with uh, with the Freedom Pop free service, and I'll be back with some follow-up videos uh, to let you know more about the service than the phone. Again, at this point, this phone is not anything we're we're too concerned about, but we'll see how it works. I uh, appreciate you watching today's video. Go ahead and, and uh, give that uh, subscribe button a click if you're not already subscribed so you don't miss the other videos. And give me a thumbs up or a like. It really helps me out. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you in the next video.